welcome to tally your pin and class today i'm going to discuss about how to do gst under tally dual gst within the state here is an example within the state and it is a we have to apply sgst and cgst sgst and cgst we have to apply both as it is a within the state no need of uh, applying igst only sgst and cgst have to be applied here you can see on the board 10% sgst and 10% cgst is applied on the goods gst is applied according to tax invoice under the below you can see tax invoice a invoice a you can see cost of goods is rupees 100 and SGST and CGST is ten percent, ten percent. On hundred, it will be twenty rupees GST rate. And invoice B, total cost of goods is two hundred. SGST is ten percent and CGST ten percent. On two hundred, it will be forty rupees GST. Tax invoice cost of goods is three hundred. As GST ten percent, CGST ten percent on three hundred, it will be sixty rupees GST. As tax invoice is applied for the furniture maker. Here is a example for the furniture making. Here you can see furniture maker, retailer, and consumer. For maker, tax invoice A applied, and re retailer tax invoice B, and final consumer is tax invoice C. As furniture maker, yes, GST paid is rupees ten rupees is paid as input tax credit, and CGST will be ten rupees. For centre furniture retailer, CGST paid is thirty minus twenty ten rupees. SGST for furniture retailer and CGST paid is ten thirty minus twenty ten rupees input tax credit. Now this way we will calculate GST in tally by using SGST and CGST within the state.